It was hoped that Harry and his brother William would start to build bridges following the Duke of Edinburgh's funeral, but the reissue of Finding Freedom is only likely to aggravate tension between the Sussexes and the firm, it has been claimed. The updated version of Finding Freedom, due to be released this summer, will further dig into the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's lives after a drama-filled year for the couple. New chapters in the book will cover the Oprah Winfrey interview, allegations against Meghan over the bullying of royal staff, which she denies, and Prince Philip's death, The Times reports. Despite initially denying any involvement in the book, Meghan later admitted she had passed information on to the authors to prevent any misrepresentation. And royal expert Duncan Larkin says the added chapters could scupper any chances of a reconciliation, after the couple's bombshell Oprah interview in March made shocking racism and mental health allegations against the royal family, and caused the couple to be cut off from the royals for good. If more negative information comes out about the royals, or in-depth details of any personal conversations between Harry and his family after the funeral are revealed, that really will be the final straw. The latest version is likely to vanquish any notions members of the firm had of a quiet summer after a hectic year. But we have to hope Harry and Meghan have been encouraged by the recent progress made during Harry's trip to the UK so that they don't do any more damage. When Harry was in the UK, for his grandfather Prince Philip's funeral, efforts at a detente fell through. The Duke of Sussex did spend time with his brother William and father Charles during the fleeting visit last month. The source said the trio looked to mend the rift between them rather than dive into the details of the fallout. Still, tensions remain between the princes, with doubts now cast over their joint unveiling of a statue of Princess Diana on what would have been her 60th birthday on July 1st. The rest of the royal family are very, very united in trying to get back to business, Russell Myers, royal editor said, adding that Prince Charles remains in a cold fury. If that is his state of mind, I think the British people will be behind him every step of the way. I think most people think that Guy Harry does not deserve to be forgiven, he said. Mayers added that rather than being in decline, the monarchy will enter a new dawn when William becomes king. I don't think it's the last straw for the monarchy. I think it's an evolution rather than a revolution, 